Good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday. I'm not gonna talk a lot. Let's show you what we're going downtown to work on. On this beautiful, fine Sunday morning in San Diego. Let's go. We're starting off strong. We gotta flip around, go grab a cart from the parking garage because they don't have carts up top. That just tells you it's a busy day. items left we didn't have three of the 18 packs so I got him the last 18 pack and then three of the 12 count that way he gets the same exact quantity so we've got a couple items we have to get at the seafood there's a line right now we're gonna try to get a couple more things real quick and then hit the seafood frozen and then get out of here Seven hundred bucks. I'm like ninety percent sure I've had this dude twice, and the last time I had him, it was like a seventy-five dollar order. A lot of drinks, and I loaded it up and then delivered it when I came out to my car. There's a seventy-five dollar ticket on my car, so we're gonna try not to do that this time. So we're gonna load it up, get up the street, and then try not to get a ticket this time. So, all right, let's take care of this. Okay, so we have been here before. Pretty sure he's still a VP. This is not the place I got a ticket, but I can still get a ticket because I'm parked in not a spot. Anyways, we've got a cart right here, and then we're gonna load up all the groceries, get them up the building, scan some ID, and see what the outcome of this is. Because I did have a couple items, one item specifically. He wanted four of these. I'm only bringing him three, because that's all they had. I asked her if she had any in the back, and she's like, eh. What's on the shelf is on the shelf, I'm like, okay. So, all right, let's take care of this. There it is, dropped it off. It did drop a dollar, which honestly could have dropped more. I have had him before and super great tip. It was like 20%. His bill was like 700 something, just under, so like 20% which was really, really good. All right, we are gonna get out of here. I don't really like being downtown on a Sunday. It's kind of busy. So we're gonna make our way north. It's a pretty good start to the day. All right, we just got inside Costco. We got a 51. It's not a good route, but it's solid. The tip's over 30 and it's only 30 items. So we're gonna run it and puts us in an area where we're gonna be able to go up to Del Mar, which honestly I'm fine with. So puts me at like 210 for the day or a little bit over. So we're gonna knock this out. There it is, nice and easy. drop that off it did take a little while to get to customer B and they live in a really nice area right over here to my right are some of the most expensive homes in San Diego like 10 20 30 million dollar homes and higher right over here and this is like a gated community as well so like could have tipped a little better but I'm happy with the order it was 51 and it ended up staying the same now we're gonna make our way out of here and try to get north because north is where we have a lot of luck and it's three o'clock so rather than going back to costco i figure this is close enough to take me north so we're at 212 for the day good start off of two batches and i'll let you guys know what we get next
All right, we are at 245 and we just picked up a 36 at Ralph's. Not that much waiting. This is a repeat. Like 90% of the time she ups the tip. So we'll see what this turns into. So we're gonna run this really quick and try to get to three as fast as possible. All right, we were in and out real quick. We did have one refund, a bag of chips. Sent her a couple pictures of other stuff. But she was like not responding, so no big deal. She might up the tip, we'll see. If not, this is good. It did go up to 37 when I started it. And we just picked up a 29. So we are, this is our, one of our favorite repeats. She's up there for sure. We're gonna go inside, make this quick. We're getting close to 400 after this. Time to take care of Jamie right now. And then we'll see what's coming out. All right, so we are back home, as you guys can see, no longer in the field. It was a pretty solid day. We did clear 400, which makes today the seventh day in a row clearing 400, which I have never done before. And yesterday, obviously, you guys will be able to see I did clear 500. I had a great day yesterday as well. But I'm extremely grateful for this week, and I really do appreciate you guys watching this video. Obviously, the 160 set the day off right. I've never woken up and just turned the app on and gotten a 160. That's never happened before. So going into this next week, I'm definitely going to take a little bit more time off, probably give myself a day's rest and not work so late like I did this past week. So hopefully after watching this video, you guys can understand that it is possible to clear $400 every single day for an entire week. It just takes longer hours some days. I'm extremely grateful for each and every order that I did this week and I regret nothing. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.